Hey guys, this is Christian from the lab, and today I just wanted to share something cool that we're doing. We're basically going to be taking apart our console. This is an Allen & Heath GL2400, uh, and we're going to be changing the way that we use it uh, quite dramatically. Essentially, we're going to be changing the way that we use the direct outputs. Up until now, they've been set at the factory setting, which is to be pre-fader metering, which means that they are not hearing any of the EQs or faders. So as we've been using it, we send our signals through it, we don't use any of the EQs, we only hear that in the room for practice, and we get a clean signal in the Pro Tools, which gives us a lot of control. But now we're excited to change it over, and we want to record all this beautiful analog EQ that we have, and so we're going to be changing the direct outputs from pre-fader to post-fader metering, and that will allow us to you know, hear everything that we do on the EQs and on the faders in Pro Tools and give us a lot more you know, hands-on control of our mixes. We're really excited and it should be pretty cool. So check it out. Here we go. He's free. As you can see, we have turned over the console and removed the back plate. And now, in order to turn each channel from pre fader to post fader, all we do is change one connection. As simple as this. Now, this channel has post fader metering uh, for the direct output, which means we'll be recording it. Now, to repeat that 23 more times. All right, so we've put the console back together and back in place. All the cables are hooked back up and we're really excited to test out how it sounds. In fact, in just a couple hours, they're gonna be rec recording a brand new jam session and we'll put a link to that video in the description below. That way you can hear how our brand new configuration sounds. Thanks for watching guys. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more awesome stuff from the lab. 